Hello, it's story time. Today's story is all about a little bunny called Little Rabbit Foo Foo. Now, Little Rabbit Foo Foo is not being very kind to his friends in the forest. He's acting very mean. So the good fairy comes down because she's not happy. She is very sad because of his attitude and gives him three chances. Shall we read the story together to find out whether little rabbit Foo Foo decides to do the right thing? Let's get started. Little rabbit Foo Foo. Little rabbit Foo Foo. Riding through the forest. Whoosh, look, he's going so fast. He's scooping up the field mice and popping them on the head. Oh no, do they look happy? No, they look kind of angry and sad. Down came the good fairy and said, Little rabbit Foo Foo, I don't like your attitude. Scooping up the field mice and bopping them on the head. I'm going to give you three chances to change. And if you don't, I'm going to turn you into a goonie. Ooh, I wonder what is a goonie. Does he look happy? No, I think he looks rather worried. Little rabbit Foo Foo riding through the forest, zoom, oh, scooping up the wriggly worms and popping them on the head. Oh no, little rabbit Foo Foo did not listen to the good fairy. How do the worms feel? Look, they are hurt. They look sad. Do you think the little rabbit Fufu should be listening to the good fairy? I think so too. Wow, look. Somebody's coming down and she does not look happy. Down came the good fairy and said, Little rabbit Fufu. I don't like your attitude. Scooping up the wriggly worms and popping them on the head. Oh, how many chances does he have left? He had three. Now he has two. You're right. You've got two chances to change. And if you don't, I'm going to turn you into a... Oh no, he does not look happy, does he? But he does need to change. He needs to stop being unkind to all his friends in the forest. Little rabbit Foo Foo, riding through the forest, scooping up the tigers and bopping them on the head. Oh no, look, the tiger looks very scared. Who's coming down? Somebody's not happy. Down came the good fairy and said, Little rabbit Foo Foo, I don't like your attitude. Scooping up the tigers and bopping them on the head. How many chances he has left? He had two, remember? Now he has one. You've got one chance left to change. And if you don't, what's going to happen? Can you remember? I'm going to turn you into a goonie. Do you think he's going to listen now? And he's going to start acting and behaving in a better way? Let's find out. Little rabbit Foo Foo. Riding through the forest, 
Zoom! Scooping up the goblins. Oh, look, they're running away. And boing, 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 boing. Bopping them on their head. Oh, no, he did not listen. What do you think is going to happen? Mm, I wonder. Let's find out. Down came the good fairy and said, Little rabbit Foo Foo, I don't like your attitude. Scooping up the goblins and boing, 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 bopping them on the head. You've got no chances left. So I'm going to turn you into a kapow, kapow. Look at him, he's suddenly changing. Oh, he's turning colours from brown to green and yellow eyes and oh no, he's now a goonie. Oh dear, I really hope he listens now so the good fairy can turn him back. He was not being very kind to his friends, was he? And that is the end. Why did little rabbit Fufu get turn into a goonie? Can you remember? Yes, he did not listen to the good fairy and he was being mean and he was being unkind. What do you think little rabbit Fufu should have done? I think so too. Well done. He should have stopped and listened and decided to do the right thing. Thank you for joining me today and I will see you soon. Goodbye.